Delta airline pilots across the country will pick it today to man better pay, benefits, and schedules. That includes right here at SeaTac. You know, they say the last contract they signed was more than six years ago, and so they say now it's time to renegotiate. Fox 13's Dan Griffin live at SeaTac International Airport for us, where pilots are planning to voice their demands a little bit later this morning. Hey, Dan. Hey, good morning to you both. So later this morning, Delta pilots are going to make it clear they're not satisfied with the status quo. You can see there's a lot of work for them to do. People lined up here for the holiday travel weekend, and this is the latest group of airline workers to voice concerns they aren't getting what they deserve. As summer travel is heating up, the Airline Pilots Association says today Delta pilots will be doing informational picketing at Delta hubs across the country. They're protesting what they call protracting contract negotiations. The pilots want better pay, retirement, job protections, and scheduling. Their last contract was signed at 2016, and Alpa says they're flying under work rules, meaning their pay rates were negotiated more than six years ago. Considering where inflation stands today, that's pretty significant. So today, they say hundreds of off-duty pilots will attend these pickets, pushing harder to get negotiations moving since the pandemic paused them through January. Scheduling has been frustrating for the pilots, who say that issues plague them just as well as customers. They say Delta canceled more flights than any other airline during Memorial Day weekend, and the chair of the Delta Alpha Master Executive Council says they're all concerned about the upcoming July 4th travel weekend. They say demand is surged back and pilots are flying record overtime, but there are still cancellations. They call this mismanagement with a lack of urgency. So right now, travelers and pilots are feeling the effects of these forces and pilots say it's not only time to bargain, but it's time to do the right thing by offering them an industry leading contract and improve the situation for everyone else. Again, later this morning, they plan to pick it. That's going to be about 10 this morning. We're going to follow up and talk with them. We've also been talking with passengers and we'll bring you what they have to say coming up in the next hour. For now, we're live at SeaTac. Dan Griffin, Fox 13 News.